naturally hear on charges that he's assaulted police officers, and you can read the news story at the description, then grabs a hold of this guard and wants to stuff him inside where there's other inmates. And now the fight is really on as they are trying to get a hold of this guard, and they do get him actually inside there with these other inmates. Obviously can't see behind the door. Um, and he is still fighting like uh, the third monkey trying to get on the ark and it's starting to rain. And he does get away from him here, but now our inmate really rocks him with that big right hand and now gets on him and is actually going to choke him unconscious in this particular case. So we see these other inmates now have grabbed the keys of this detention officer and is now uh, you know, going to grab his stuff and start opening doors and inviting other people into the fray while our uh, our officer here is completely helpless, just completely out. You can see him here trying to regain his consciousness a little bit, but, you know, trying to recover from loss of consciousness like that, pretty significant. Now, another guard shows up and starts trying to help this guy. And, oh, okay, what are we going to do? Third one's going to show up here. Now, pretty interesting, watch what goes down here as we get our first guard kind of back on his feet. This uh, second or third officer shows up and just gets laid out. One punch and done. And the other guy comes, gets laid out as well. So, I mean, this guy's just handing out naps right now. Uh, and, and so we have uh, one guard in the top right who is completely, you know, back on his feet, but, but really a mess. Two that are completely out. This guy's swinging punches at the fourth guard here. And all of a sudden, he is the heavyweight champ of this maximum security cell block. Now, thankfully, that fourth guard kind of stayed at bay a little bit. Now the inmates run the asylum for just a minute, speed it up for the sake of time. And pretty quick here, now what you're going to see is at least one shows up with a taser and that gets everybody back into their cells. So then that way, at least we can start getting the, the guards who are out, the officers who are completely out here to get some help. Doors get closed and now the polyester pileup is going to show up. And uh, thankfully, I think everyone is